Climate Action Superheroes. My name is Langley and I'm back to bring you your weekly climate action challenge. 50 years since the very first Earth Day, thousands of citizen science projects. First, if you haven't found out what your inner climate action superhero is, head over to climate-heroes.org anytime. We made a digital version of our museum exhibit so you can have fun and still make a difference at home. Now, over the last five weeks, we have given you a different challenge every week to help out each of our five climate action superheroes. We've also learned a little bit about each of those superheroes. We learned that no matter what your superpower is, we all have the ability to work together to make an even bigger difference for our planet. If you haven't had a chance to check out our weekly missions, head to nationalchildrensmuseum.org slash steamwork and click on the Climate Action Challenge link. Remember, if you choose to take on all five of the missions, you'll win a small prize and be entered to win a museum membership. Just remember to take a photo or a video and show us when the museum reopens. Last Wednesday, April 22nd was Earth Day. And did you know that it's been 50 years since the very first Earth Day? And we've been celebrating every year since. On Earth Day, people around the world come together to celebrate our planet and find new ways to help save it. This year, since we are all staying home, people are coming up with ways to connect and help in their own homes and communities. At climate-heroes.org, you can find ways that you can help our planet. There are activities, including our hashtag Steamwork Challenges and Citizen Science Projects. And today, I wanna to talk to you a little bit more about Citizen Science. Citizen Science Projects are a collaboration between people like you and me and scientists all around the world. We can help scientists make discoveries by recording and reporting observations. There are thousands of Citizen Science Projects happening around the world right now. We challenge you to get involved in a Citizen Science Project. As a pollinator patrol myself, I'm going to help scientists track the monarch butterflies as they migrate north by observing and recording sightings in my neighborhood. But you can also help track light pollution and marine debris in your neighborhood. You can observe and document the trees in your community, and you can use the weather journals we made last week to help scientists track weather patterns in your part of the world. You can find these citizen science projects on the Climate Action Headquarters at climate-heroes.org, or you can find even more by visiting scistarter.org. Let us know how you are helping scientists by tagging us on Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter. Remember dreamers, Steamwork makes the dream work and we're all in this together. Tune in tomorrow for a science Steamwork. Bye.